Hey guys, so today I'm here to do another Hyped Up video with you. If you're not familiar with the Hyped Up video series that I've been doing, I started a, I don't know, it's probably like three or four months ago, and basically these are just reviews on products that I've seen a lot of either advertised on my Facebook and other social media sites, or maybe seen a lot of YouTube vloggers do reviews on. Yeah, that's what these videos are kind of about. So today, if you're not, well, if you can't already tell from the title, I am doing a review on the Helix mattresses. If you're not familiar with Helix mattresses, I really, here's what happened. So my daughter has been complaining about the mattress that she's had. If you guys don't know, I do have a 12, almost 13 year old daughter and she has our old queen size mattress when we upgraded ours to a king size. It's literally only probably, what? how old is Kaya? She's like almost five. It's less than four years old. Uh, me and John, collectively, we've never had a brand new mattress up until that point. Back then, we did not have a lot of money. We just bought the first like semi-comfortable or comfortable to him, it was super uncomfortable to me, uh, kind of like foam mattress because that's what John really wanted. So, you know, we did one of those, used our tax return, bought this new mattress. So when we upgraded to a king size, we gave that in our old bed set to my daughter, which I thought was huge because when I was her age, I was on a twin mattress that was like my grandma's old mattress that was handed down to my my older brother and then that was handed out to me like it was a old mattress so I thought you know like oh she gets you know she's gonna be so excited she gets this you know a queen size mattress and bed frame and all of this other stuff and she did not like the mattress and has not liked it she's only been on it for about a year but she would always complain that it was a little bit too firm I shouldn't say complain because if you guys know my daughter she's very very sweet and doesn't really complain often she's very grateful for what she has but you know there I would ask her I said you know are you really comfortable on that because I wasn't very comfortable on it you know it wasn't made for me it was made for my husband who's a little bit heavier as you guys know than me you know it was a very firm mattress I would ask her every once in well, do you really like that mattress? And she just would be like, well, it kind of hurts my back. It's not very comfortable, that kind of thing, which I didn't blame her because again, I thought the same thing, which is why we got a new mattress and it's a king size mattress. So with that being said, I was already looking for a new mattress for my daughter. And right as I was looking online, I saw an opportunity to work with Helix and I thought, you know what, this is perfect because I wanted to do a hyped up video on these like bed in a box type services and how they work. And Helix was perfect because my friend Sam, as you guys saw, if you watch her channel, she did a review and unboxing of them. And she actually really, really likes hers. Like I legit grilled her, I'm like, listen, do you like your mattress? Because I really, like, I really want to know if it's like an ideal brand to work with. She's like, yeah, I love my mattress. They still sleep on it, all of those good things. So it just worked out and it was kind of like in the stars for me and Helix to collaborate together. So I was super excited. They provided us a queen size mattress for my daughter for free for this video and are sponsoring this video. So thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much to Helix. I'm just going to say that right now. Thank you to my subscribers for making these types of videos possible. My daughter is excited to to finally be benefiting from my channel because you guys know I don't show her on my channel because of the age that she's at and also because of just that's what me and her father decided for her is to keep her off social media. You know, she doesn't always get to uh, benefit from the things that my channel brings in. So this was like huge and she was so excited to be a part of it. With that being said, I will be telling you guys how she felt about her mattress. But yeah, so starting off, that was a long introduction. The process of ordering the mattress was really interesting. It was nice. You just go to their website, which I will leave linked below. They also provide me with a $50 coupon code, which I'll leave right here for you guys if you decide to order a mattress yourself. But going to their website, it was really easy. You just kind of do their little bed quiz. And what's nice is that you get to put in your stats, you know, whoever's going to be sleeping on there. So I put in, you know, Ava's height, her weight, all of those types of things. And then if you do sleep with a partner or somebody else, you can put their stats in too. And then you can either choose to have your preferences combined throughout the whole mattress or have them separated one side to the other. I did strictly stick to her preferences when it came to how firm she liked things, how much support she needed, whether or not she was a back or side sleeper or a stomach sleeper. And then also another question was, you know, how much do you overheat at night? Like how much is, how much cooling system or whatever do you need to put in the mattress? For her, even though she's tinier than me, she runs so hot. I don't know what it is, but she runs so hot. She can have her air conditioner blasting at like 60 degrees and the fan on high, and she's still like, Mom, I'm sweating, I'm hot. That was really cool about that mattress. I love that we could integrate that into it. 
uh, our mattress doesn't have that. I actually joked with her, I'm like, you know, you have a nicer mattress than your mom and stepdad as of right now, uh, which she thought was really cool. So after you take the quiz, you finalize it, they give you your results and tell you kind of what mattress it is and all this stuff. And then you have the choice to whether or not you want to like change things or tweak things and all of that just to make sure it's right for you. And then you send the quiz in and then you can buy your size mattress. So in regards to shipping for us, it probably took about, I want to say, 10 days for us to get our mattress, which I thought was pretty impressive. It was just dropped off on our front door. It is super heavy, I will say that. You know, it's not something that my husband couldn't bring in by himself from the front porch, but in regards to taking it up the stairs and not, you know, hurting his back and all of that, he did have a little bit of help. But he did unpackage it by himself. So first off, I want to talk about the box. Like it's, I, I still can't believe that a queen size mattress fit in this dang box. Like it, it was impressive how like compressed this mattress was to fit in this box. They do say on it specifically, do not leave it in the box for more than two weeks because then it starts, you know, degrading the quality of the mattress so you want to make sure to unpack it as soon as possible uh, but like I said it fit I'm surprised <laughs> I'm seriously still shocked like when I think back I'm like I don't even know how they fit it in there like my sister when I told her about it because she's staying the night this weekend I'm like Molly you get to try out the new mattress you know we did a bed in the box type thing and they've been actually looking into that and I've had a lot of friends ask me about them too and she's like I just want to know like how did it fit in that box so um, as you'll see from the clips it was super compressed down with like this really thick plastic and then somehow they folded it in half as well and then rolled it and then that's how it fit in like I said John was able to get out of the box and set it up all on his own I just kind of sat there and filmed him uh, just so you guys could see the process and then we laid it out on the bed frame and then after that you just kind of cut open the plastic and once the air hits the plastic the whole thing just like fills What'd you do? Oh my gosh. <laughs> One thing that I really, really, really liked about this versus our foam mattress that was actually a bed in the box too, but we got it from some big box store who, the salesperson was terrible. He didn't listen to what I wanted um, at all. He really talked us into a mattress that really wasn't right for us as you can tell because we don't still have it. it. Actually did come in a box as well. The difference though was that with the Helix mattress, it said, okay, it only needs 45 minutes to set up on its own. Whereas the foam mattress or temp fake Tempur-Pedic mattress, we actually had to wait I think it was 48 hours. If you guys go back into those vlogs, I vlogged about it a long time ago. I had to sleep downstairs on our old mattress while the other one aired out and like got fluffier or whatever for like two nights with John uh, because that's how long it took to set up. Whereas the Helix, it was like after 45 minutes, you're good to go, which it was totally true. I let it actually sit for like six hours because, you know, we set up in the morning and I just let it go. Um, and then I went to go make the bed because my mom was staying the night and it was like, amazing. Getting into how the bed actually performed. I will say it is a lot softer. It's weird. It was a lot softer and plushier than the old mattress, but yet it still had support. I will say when I was making the bed and kind of just walking around on my mattress, I could feel kind of the support in there and the springs in there, but it was weird because when I laid on it, I couldn't feel anything but like soft pillowy goodness. <laughs> it was really, really nice. You know, I'm 130 pounds. My husband's about 200 my mom's a little bit more than that so me Ava who's like a hundred pounds almost and John and my mom all laid in it I actually fell asleep napping on it this morning I'm not gonna lie and, and we all said that it felt really soft but supportive which I think is strange that all of us with different body types could feel that way but it, it did. My mom's night in it, she was the first one to sleep in it because Ava was at her dad's and she said she absolutely thought it was super comfortable. That I thought was a great like, okay, Ava's gonna love this, like she's gonna love it. If my mom thinks it's soft but supportive, she's gonna love it. Then Ava laid in it and she was so happy. The, the first thing she said was, it's so much softer than the last one. And I was so relieved. I'm like, oh good, like I'm so happy. And she loved it. She said she didn't sweat at all at night. She said it was super comfortable and she was really, really excited about it. 
John laid on it for a little bit. He hasn't slept slept on it, but he laid on it and he said he, he even agreed that it was more comfortable than the other one, which he actually liked the old one. And then for me, in my honest opinion, I went up there because I wanted to actually legit see how it felt, you know, and lay and kind of relax in it because yeah, I'm making this video for you guys and I wanted to give you my honest opinion. And I actually fell asleep. I was like, I'm just going to lay here for a few minutes and just kind of see what it's like. I was on my phone and suddenly I was asleep and then 45 minutes later, I was woken by my dog sniffing my face. That just goes to show that it's a super comfortable mattress or I'm just super tired, I don't know. But I mean, it was comfortable. Like I felt like it was soft, it didn't feel uncomfortable. It was really nice. So in regards to how comfortable it was and all of that, how easy it was to install, how easy that it was to just kind of do the quiz and everything, like it was pretty cut and dry and it was pretty darn like simple and it was really nice like there was no dealing with salespeople who are super annoying who you can't really like I don't know I just I hate mattress shopping like if I could list the things that I hate doing out in the real world it would be buying a new car buying a new mattress or buying a new phone plan like I hate those three things I love the fact that I didn't have to talk to anybody <laughs> at all to figure out all this mattress stuff and we still got a really nice mattress. Now moving on to my favorite part about the Helix mattresses and the company itself. They do give you a hundred sleep day or day sleep. They do give you a hundred days of sleep trial period to see if you like your mattress. So for all of you guys who may be a little bit scared to order something online, especially like a mattress that you haven't you know, slept on or anything like that, you might not be happy with it. You have 100 days from the day it gets to your door to decide whether or not you're happy with it. And if you're unhappy with it for any reason, you can get a refund and they will come and pick up your mattress, take it away from you, and it's like nothing ever happened. So I think that's really cool to work with a company that stands behind their brand like that. When I choose to do these types of collaborations and, sponsor and sponsorships, I don't do it lightly. I definitely do my research on a company. I want to make sure that the customer service is there. I want to make sure that there are guarantees in place for people to be satisfied. Like I want to make sure that the company that I'm working with is worth promoting. So with Helix mattresses, you can be guaranteed to love the mattress that you have. And if not, then you can have your money back. Another really neat thing, which is probably my most favorite thing about the company, which if you guys know me, you know why this is my favorite thing. With every return mattress, they do try to donate it somewhere if it's in a good condition and if it abides by the state's laws that it's in, which I think is really, really not only just like socially responsible and you know, just kind but is just I don't know I just think it's really cool it's just really neat so if it's not possibly donated and they recycle it responsibly and all of that so in the long run it just really helps make your decision to order something like that online a little bit easier so there you have it there's my honest review of the helix mattress and just the process and basically just bed in the boxes I was very skeptical of all of just the process itself but I'm a believer now. <laughs> I'm definitely a believer. So let me know if you've ever tried, you know, a bed in the box type service. Let me know if you've tried Helix or are going to. Like I said, I do have a promo code right here for you, which is $50 off your purchase. And I'll leave a link below for you to follow to go take your mattress quiz and get your own. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful for any of you guys kind of considering, you know, what kind of brand to go with, you know, where to go for a mattress. Again, I want to say thank you to Helix Mattress for giving me this opportunity and for supplying my daughter with just an awesome mattress. She's so happy and I'm just happy that she's happy and thank you to you guys as always for watching my videos because like I always say none of this would be possible without you so I hope you're having a wonderful day and you are enjoying these types of videos if you are please make sure to give them a thumbs up subscribe if you want to see more videos and I will talk to you all in my next video